Here we show a 25 uh, task assembly process here. Now the problem here of course is if you start to, it's kind of hard to read what's going on here so you're probably going to start scrolling in. So you can start sc zooming in a little bit, you can move it around here, you can raise the, uh, the scroll up vertically as well. So if pretty quickly you start to lose perspective of where you are in the process. You could be anywhere here now. It's a little easy here because it's task 6, 7, 8 and so forth. But normally you'd have task names down here, which makes it very difficult to remember where you are. So there's a real nice feature here called the perspective up here. We click on that and it shows you a presentation of what the process looks like. You can size this any way you want here. And look what happens here as I move around here on my main uh, balance area. Look at the little crosshairs at the top there. That shows you where you are here. So if I was to scroll it out to the right here, and then move it back up, you see it picks up where we are right here. It's also very good for locating to a particular point. So maybe you want to go to a certain station. You can click on it here. It will actually position you right to that particular uh, station, preserving the zooming that you've already set up here. So if you want to move around down to the bottom here, you can click here. So it gives you an excellent way to quickly navigate around and also see where you are within the process at any point in time. So let's say you wanted to grab this guy and drag it over here. You can see that actually taking place on the uh, up in the um, in the perspective here. Another nice use of the perspective is when you have a multi-model here. It's the same thing, you know, you can't quite read everything, there's a lot of detail in here. So if you go to the perspective, you'll see it actually shows up here. So you can see your different stations representing what's going on down here. So again, if you zoom it, if you scroll around, and you maybe move around here to different stations, here you can see it's a little harder to know where you are, but right here, because of the perspective, you can see exactly where you are at any point in time. If you want to go to a particular location, say the very top of this one, to see what's going on up here, just click on it, it'll put you right there, and it shows you the details of what you're seeing, uh, where you are in the screen right here. So again, the perspective is an excellent tool to let you get an overview of what's going on in a complicated process.